in order to sharpen the electrode for the TIG welder, simply uh, locate the electrode sharpener. Uh, this is a special tool just for sharpening electrodes. We're going to go ahead and open the case. We're going to plug it in. We're going to verify that we're at approximately a 30 degree angle uh, when we sharpen this. We're going to take our electrode holder. This works similarly to the TIG torch. We're going to put the electrode all the way into the holder. So there's about an inch sticking out. Uh, you're going to be inserting it into this pocket right here. And it's very critical that when you insert into that pocket, you ensure that it's in the middle and you go all the way and then you just tighten this down. This is going to set our electrode to a predetermined length. So when we put it into the sharpener, it sharpens appropriately. So once we have this tightened down, we simply just start the sharpener, which is a little grinding wheel. see that sharpens that to a perfect point. Uh, in order to weld steel with the TIG welder, the electrode has to be sharpened to a point. What this is going to do is going to focus all of the energy into one portion and we'll get a nice clean weld bead. So then we'll go ahead and remove this. This is hot, so you want to make sure you have a glove on if you um, grab the end of it. Remove that, set that off to the side, and I'm going to show you why this doesn't work. So if you have an electrode like this, this is not going to work. If you put this in the sharpener, you notice it just gets caught and it doesn't get set to a predetermined length. See how short that is? Because where it's supposed to be going into this, essentially the distance setting mechanism on this, which is just a... Uh, a hollow cavity uh, this is too large to fit into that cavity and it's not set appropriately so remember if you have an electrode that looks like that you need to go ahead and cut that off the hacksaw